to us yeah. what the 22nd chapter, chapter says. So he's drunk. He like having fun. <laughs> don't want to he, like, he like having fun. I had a beer, too. I know you have a beer, too. Maybe some of you are listening. Go ahead. This is Sirach 22 and 14. Well, we got people listening, man. We just don't. You're not going to get it. Too long. Too long. Okay, that's good. I'm good. Have a good day. <laughs> Look at that leadhead. That's, that's a leadhead right there. Look, he bumped into people. That's a leadhead. Yeah. But you know, and he even saw him being like, you know, it's not even about color. It's, it's about actions, man. It's spirit. You know, it's about spirit, man. 22 and 11. Give me 22 and 11. This is Sirach 22 and 11. We call these people that come up here and do what they do. They ain't nothing but lead. I'm going to show you why, man. Yeah, All right. You want me to start from 14 or 11? 11, brother. Sirach 22 and 11. Weep for the dead, for he have lost the light. Uh -huh. And weep for the fool, for he wanteth understanding. Make little weeping for the dead, for he is at rest. See that? The Bible said, make little weeping for the dead. That's the dude you're supposed to cry for. Because he don't even know what he's doing, bro. He don't even understand that the angels are around us right now, bro. There's angels that's around us right now, bro. Give me that, uh, Psalm 34 and 7. Keep it in, brother. But the life of the fool is worse than death. You see that? The life of a fool is worse than death, brother. That dude's life is actually worse than dying, bro. He's better off just, just dying, man. Because his life is pointless, man. It's cheaper than dirt. Go ahead. God, verse 12. Seven days do men mourn for him that is dead. Right, so in the Bible, when somebody dies, you're supposed to mourn for them for seven days, man. After seven days, man, yo, you're supposed to be over that, man, because you're supposed to understand the concept of life and death. Go ahead. Continuing on. But for a fool and an ungodly man all the days of his life. Right, man. For a fool, that's a lifetime of grief, man. Yeah. You trying to wake somebody up that want to be a fool, they're going to they gonna just be a fool. They don't want to know nothing. They, yo, bro, yo, you want to go smoke this weed? Yo, we got to meet these people over here. Where are you going? The Lord can say that we're a damn, uh, a piece of a fragment of a building drop on your damn head. And he give you an opportunity to come in his truth. And you, you just want to do your thing. And you have never done your thing. Everything you did, the Lord has made you done. There's no such thing as free will. Every person you met, everybody that you know, everybody that you met in the past, you were supposed to meet. That helped your elevation of growth. So now when you meet the ultimate truth, so you gotta decide from here on what you're gonna do. Because you know it, you know what time it is. You know? Go ahead. Con. This is verse verse 12. Seven th oh, no, no, so like it. verse 13. Talk not much with the fool. See that? The Bible said don't talk much to a fool. Why, why? What's going to happen if you keep talking to a damn fool? Go ahead. Con, talk not much with a fool, and go not to him that have no understanding. Right, man, don't spend no time talking to a dude that don't got understanding. What the hell you want to listen to Kanye West for? What is he telling you about, man? One minute. What is he going to talk to you about, man? What the hell you want to go in these concerts for? What can you learn? The world is about to be destroyed. Why do you want to dress like these dudes, man? I'm going to be enlightened to this truth. You take the blue pill, you're going to go into the world. And this truth is not for everybody, brother. I know it's hard. Because we look very stupid amongst thousands of people walking past us. Yo, these dudes just yelling. They sound angry. We're not angry. That's a false illusion, bro. We're very happy. That rap, that rap music be sounding angry. Right. You know yeah. what I'm saying? We, we out here, man. We. There's no love in that. This right. dude, Game, said he was protesting for Black Lives Matter. Then two weeks later, he told me he wanted to kill Nick Mills. That don't even make no damn sense, man. Right. Damn all. hypocrite. And these are the people that they put on the pedestal, man. Get it, brother. Read that part again. Surprise. 22 and 13. God. Talk not much with the fool, and go not to him that have no understanding. Beware of him. Let's thou have trouble. Right, man. Be, he gonna contaminate you, bro. That's why you can't be around dudes that you used to hang out with before you come in the truth. You gotta cut them off. Because all they gonna do, they gonna bring you back into that BS world. Right. You gotta cut them dudes off. They they are cancerous, bro. They, they gonna contaminate you, bro. And then you gonna be polluted like them. Nah, they're gonna start, you're gonna start to see their spirit. They're gonna start not really gonna deal with you. Right, they're gonna start saying you corny. Yeah. Cause we've been through this already, bro. But it don't matter. Because the Lord set up other brothers that's just like you. It's not, and guess what? We wasn't born to be fly. We was born, we section eight, baby. We crack babies, bro. Some of us. 
You know? Go ahead. It says, Beware of him, lest thou have trouble, and thou shalt never be defiled with his fooleries. Yeah, you won't be defiled with his fooleries. Yo, bro, yo, you heard about LeBron James, yo, Kevin Durant. The same old stuff every day. Right. Smoking weed. Yo, so you heard about this? Gossiping. It's, it's, it ain't putting no money in your pocket. It ain't helping you out. No, you think LeBron James, Kevin Durant care if you like the fact that he went to Golden State? He don't give a damn about you, man. That dude will walk past you and have sex with your girl, man. You think Jay-Z give a damn about what you what you say, bro? Cut. So what you out here doing? Who you out here proving shit for? You you out here, you get them, you get in with these females, that's prostitutes. First of all, ain't none of y'all ever have a, I don't know, but if you ain't dealing with a virgin, she a prostitute basically, man. But she already, yeah, you get sloppy seconds, man. So really, you ain't really getting nothing in this world. You under a false illusion, bro. Go ahead. It says, depart from him and thou shalt find rest. And never be disquieted with madness. Right, you ain't gonna be, you don't deal with that madness, man. We didn't, I got to, didn't talk to that dude. He's a damn leadhead. I don't talk to leadheads. Okay? Go ahead. Verse 14. What is heavier than lead? The Bible says, what's heavier than lead? What you know heavier than lead? Go ahead. Right, that thing is dense, man. You put lead in the water, going to the bottom of the ocean. It says, um, and what is the name thereof but a fool? Right. And what and what is the name of the, but a fool? A fool is like lead, man. Don't you know you get too much lead in your system, you could die? So why would y'all consistently hang out with dudes that's negative, man? That ain't right. Dudes that will steal money from you. Dudes that you know don't got no principles, no morals, but yet you still still you still hang out with them. That don't make any sense. That's like if I'm a street dude and I hang out with a bunch of rats because we grew up together. I can't deal with this dude because at any given time he's gonna tell on me. We're presented the right opportunity. So why do why do brothers in the hood still hang out with these clowns, man? Right. These dudes are lace up blunt, man. Dudes ain't your friends, man. They never bring you. How many times your mother said that to y'all? These guys ain't your friends. They don't love you. The streets don't love nobody. Right, Good. It says, um, sand and salt and a mass of iron is easier to bear than a man without understanding. See that? If you take a bag of sand, a bag of salt, a bag of iron, it still ain't gonna weigh more heavier than a dude that's a fool, man. And that's heavy, man. You, if you ever did a, a CrossFit and, you, and they put them weight vests on you, man, that thing is heavy, man. That's still. It's not going to be heavier than a damn fool. Yeah, right. Because a fool is meant to dumb you down. Yeah, that's it. If you, listen, if your everyday conversation with your boy is talking about cars, clothes, hoes, marijuana, video games, sports, oh, drugs, no. entertainment, you were a fool. Cut. 24-7 to the whole the, day. Every time that link up. Yo, bro, you see that girl with the fat ass? Yo, look at the Instagram. Yo, look at the Instagram page. Yo, look at Yo, look uh, Yo, 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 man, you, you deserve to get played, man. Right. You deserve everything that come your way, man. Because you a future leadhead. You a leadhead in training. Yeah. Yeah. It says, um, verse 16. As timber girt and bound together in a building cannot be loosed with shaking, it's comparing it to um, like a pillar. You know what I'm saying? Something that's that's deeply rooted, like this pole, like as like a pole or a tree cannot be shaken or taken out. Yeah, because it has a foundation. Right. So the reason why y'all do is be getting shook. Y'all don't really know what's going on. Y'all in and out sometimes because y'all don't have no foundation. God. Every house got to be built on foundation. Hey, give me that uh, man that builds house for sand. Every house got to build their house on a foundation. If you don't build your house on a foundation, you're going to be done. You got them dudes that built their foundation on the Nation of Islam. They're done. You got them dudes that built their foundation on Noble Jew Ali. They're done. I'm talking about the Moorish science, how they Moors. They don't got to pay taxes. They in jail. You got to endure, brother. If you're not in his truth, you will not endure. And whether you believe it or not, 
that don't mean destruction ain't coming your way. Like you can fight Mike Tyson. Whether you, you, you may not believe yo, you know what? Tyson, Tyson may knock me out. Guess what? Tyson might kill you with a punch. Register. You just, you just looking at, yo, well, if I just die, then I just die. But you might mess up your whole inheritance, brother. Because you only seeing physical. You can't see physical when it's true, bro. Life is spiritual, bro. Always remember that, bro. Don't ever get caught up in color, man. Color is going to get you killed, bro. Right. See that, bro. Don't always trust everything you see, man. Yeah. Right. It says, um, I'm finishing verse 16. It says, uh, so the heart that is, is that established by advised counsel shall fear at no time. Right, man. When that time comes, if you are established with wise counsel, you're not going to fear. What you going to do if the economy crashed tomorrow? Are you prepared for that? Have you even thought about that? What you do if you went tomorrow and you say, yo, we just went to war with Russia? You want to come out here and try to find us that next Saturday? But we're not going to be out here. That's when we're not going to be out here no more. Because they know who we are. So then you're going to be done. You're going to be like, oh, sweat. Yo, them dudes on foot. Yo, they were just telling me that, son. Boom! Kicking your door. Put you in the closet and you done. What you going to do? You better hope you see one of us in concentration camp. Because if you don't, you finished, bro. You don't know the name. You don't know who to call on. You don't, you, you, man, you, you can't, y'all brothers in a, y'all in a good situation because y'all hearing us right now, but in, in a way, y'all really in a, a messy situation, bro. Right. Straight up, bro. Yeah. Right. Nah, that's it. It goes to verse 17. That's good, that's good, that's good. Give me Jeremiah 37. Yeah, good job. Matthew 7 and 24. Therefore, you see that? Therefore, whosoever heareth these sayings of mine, and do of them, I will liken him unto a wise man. Right, you hear that? If you hear the Lord saying and you do them, he gonna liken to you as a wise man. Right. All right? These dudes is not gonna make it, bro. They didn't make it in the Great Depression. They didn't make it in uh, 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 Titus and Vespasian. Right. See, a lot of people don't really understand our enemy because they don't know his history. They don't go into the Roman history. They don't go into the Babylonian history. They don't go into the Greeks. They don't do that. They don't go into the Medio Persian Empire. You gotta understand who our enemy was, bro. These people made a, they came to agreements to take us down. You mean to tell me nobody else knew we was going to slavery? Where was China at? Where was Russia at? All these countries existed. Give me that Psalms 83. That was that? I would liken him unto a wise man which built his house upon a rock. See, you gotta, y'all brothers gotta build your houses on a rock, bro. If y'all brothers don't build your, cause you're, you a house, brother. You a house and you a house. If you don't build your house on a rock, brother, you're not gonna make it, bro. This world is nothing, bro. When I was younger, you know what was popping? Iceberg, Coogee. I used to buy all of it. I used to do stupid stuff for it. Guess what happened? After Iceberg Coogee was the next fad. There's another fad after that. It's gonna, it's gonna be more fast after that, bro. That's all the world can give you is, is money, cars, and uh, material things, bro. Nah, it gotta be more to life than that, bro. You gotta, you gotta sit on top of the TV and watch the couch. Stop sitting on the couch watching the TV. Look at the room from a different perspective. It gotta be some. Uh, listen, if this is a globe and there's other planets out there, it gotta be more, more to life than what you're doing. That's common sense, bro. It gotta be more to it. It can't be, yo, I'm trying to fuck this chick. It gotta be more to that, bro. Got to be, man. Yeah. Verse 25. And the rain descended, and the flood came, and the winds blew and beat upon that house. You see that, brother? Like you had that story about the three little piggies? You know what I'm saying? One, one was made on straw, the other one was made in, what, a brick? And the other one was made on uh, bricks, sticks and bricks, sticks. sticks, right? And when the wolf, hey, and when the wolf came, he blew the hay down. When the wolf came, he blew the sticks down. But when the rock, he couldn't blow it down. Why? Because it was sturdy. Hey, and when this thing happened, let me see that martial law song. Give me two martial law scriptures. When this thing happened, bro, trust me. All that tough Tony stuff you see, you did, all these YouTube dudes. You're gonna see the female come out them, bro. And that always happened with Jake. Dude, hey, hey, dudes, hey, dudes, dudes be in the hood acting that hard. 
And once the cops come, what happens? Your heart starts beating different. You're like, oh shit. Keep calm. You guess what? Imagine when they turn up on you, bro. When they got the green light to turn up on you. You're gonna see the female coming out of a lot of these dudes, man. Watch, mark my word. Remember I told you that, brother. Remember through the spirit of your how about shit, I was shot, I told you that. You're gonna see the female come out of these dudes, man. And if you don't come in this truth, you won't be done, brother. And it fell not, for it was founded upon a rock. It fell not because it was founded upon a rock. These people ain't gonna make it, bro. Look at them, man. They shop. You think of a terrorist attack that's happening right now? What are these people gonna do, man? Hit it up. They gonna run. I mean, we gonna we gonna run too. But the Lord ain't gonna let nothing happen around us. I, but we believe we protected. We believe we protected. You know. Verse twenty six. And everyone that heareth these sayings of mine and doeth them not shall be likened unto a foolish man. See that? If you hear what we say and you don't take heed to it, then you you a leadhead. You a leadhead. Because if somebody telling you, yo, listen, wear condom, you're, going, you, you, you're, going, you're not going to get any diseases, and you still raw dogging it, and when you catch what you catch, it's on you. <laughs> That's on you. You know? Go ahead. Shall be likened unto a foolish man which built his house upon sin. Right, you built your house upon sin. Yep. That, that house is going to be blown away. Yep. Trust me. Go ahead. And the rain descended, and the flood came, and the winds blew, and beat upon that house, and it fell, and great was the fall of it. And great was the fall of it. That's going to be a scary thing, man. You going to see your cousins get killed? Your mom's going to be killed? What are you doing to build your spirit up to that, man? A lot of dudes going to bug out. Y'all ever seen uh, Book of Eli? Y'all might got to watch that movie one day, man. Put a priest that go right with this. All right, brother. Hold on for a minute. You ever seen the Book of Eli? That's what's going to happen, bro. You're going to see death. You're going to see people eating people. And what you going to bug out? You can't bug out. You got to make sure you, you keep your insanity. Because you're going to bug out when you see that because you're not trained for that. See, when you train for that, you ain't you, you can deal with the punch. But if you're not training, you come to the gym, you eat Snickers, hoagies, and then you fight Floyd Mayweather, he's going he gonna, he gonna to blow you out. He's going to blow you up. He's going to blow you out the flame. But you ain't training yourself for that. Yeah. Yeah. Sirach 5 and 7. Make no tarry and to turn to the Lord. Right. You know, brother? Don't don't tarry. I mean, don't play with this, man. God. Right. Don't be like, yo, you know what? Yo, I come in this thing. God, right, bro, yeah, okay. Nah, man. I mean, the fear of the most high is not on you. And don't let nobody tell you, yo, nah, man, I ain't doing that. Then you, all right, bro, you do what you do. You got to be your own man.